These balloons represent just a fraction of the lives lost since the B.C. government declared a public health emergency over the overdose crisis on this date six years ago. Moms Stop the Harm set up at 10 Starbucks locations to speak with members of the public about the dangers of street drugs as they continue to press government to ensure a safe supply. You know, uh, overdose is happening all over. It uh, does not discriminate and is taking lives of our loved ones at the rate of seven a day in British Columbia. She says stigma over drug use creates barriers so people who need help don't seek it out and end up dying alone. David has been on his own journey for several years. He believes governments are starting to realize the importance of safe supply. Very slowly, but uh, we, we need that. We really do. And it would help a lot of people, especially, the, like I said, the ones that are deep in it and uh, there's a lot of trauma involved, you know, a lot of traumatic factors. So uh, me, it was prescription, other people could be for other reasons, but regardless of reasons, we shouldn't put a stigma on that. At the current death rate from overdoses, BC will surpass 10,000 lives lost by this summer. In Kelowna, Cindy White, Castanet.